He is a hero at work, but a superhero at home. Hi, Dad. Dr. Min Tran <laughs> wanted to keep a promise to his seven-year-old daughter, Hannah. I have something for you. Uh, I've taken her to the daddy-daughter dance here for the last years now. Super Dad wanted to take his little girl to a father-daughter dance. I think we also wanted her to be able to have a good memory of something, even during a time when it's not very memorable, having a lot of uncertainty, a lot of fear going on right now. Dr. Tran is a heart surgeon and on the front lines against the coronavirus. But in the midst of chaos, he wanted corsages and dancing. Men just said, you know, hey, I want um, to, I, I think we should still do the dance. And I said, oh, she might forget about it. He said, no, I, it's important. I think we should still do it. She'll, have, she'll get a kick out of it and she'll just love it. So Dr. Tran and his wife hung Christmas lights and decorations in their living room for one special night. What was your favorite song? Tell her. Dance Monkey. <laughs> Which one? Dance Monkey. These are hard times for doctors and nurses and their families as they worry about their health and the future. It's almost like a time bomb. I, I don't, you know, sometimes I don't know if he's, if he's, going to get sick or if he's going to catch this. I just pray each day that he doesn't and that he doesn't bring it home. Dr. Tran says he has to take precautions when he gets home. There's always a ritual, though, when I get home. First thing, I take everything off, hit the showers first before I give him hugs and kisses. Doctors are making so many sacrifices, so creating moments like these bring happiness and memories that will last a lifetime. In Arlington, I'm Rebecca Lopez.